Hi, this is Greg Hughes from 90 Second Website Builder. I'm going to talk to you a little bit about Google Analytics and how to add that snippet of code to your website. It's very simple to do in 90 Second Website Builder. Probably the harder part is knowing where to get that code. First of all, you need to have a Google account, so I'm going to go into mine. Most of us have a Google account of some kind. If you have a Gmail address or a YouTube account, most of us have a Google account. You may not necessarily be subscribed to the Google Analytics part of that, so you need to add that service to your Google account if you haven't. Google Analytics is a service that Google provides that allows you to put a snippet of code on your website so you can analyze your traffic and look at certain things about who's going to your website, such as demographics. The first thing you need to do is have a Google account, have the Google Analytics service as part of that account, and then go into that account and click on the administration area. This is where you can manage the properties. Now, when Google uses the word property, they mostly mean a website. So you can add properties to your account. In this case, you can add a website or a web address to your account. So I'm going to do that here as a demonstration. We're going to click on Create New Property. As you can see in this case, I can have as many as 50 properties in this same account. So I could be managing multiple websites. So we'll click on Create New Property, and we're telling Google that it is a website. And we need to tell them the name of that website. So that's an actual name, not an address. The address goes down here. And then they're going to want us to pick a category of some kind. Your country and time zone. Okay, now what we want to do is we want to get the identification number or that snippet of code. And so this is what Google is going to give us now. It's called a Universal Analytics or UA code. So we're going to click this button and get our code. That's what we're looking for right here, this tracking number. This is the number that distinguishes our website so that we can put a snippet of code into it and Google can keep track of who's visiting it. The page that they take you to will have some information about this tracking code. The most important thing you want from this is the actual code snippet, and it looks like this right here. It's a script. Now remember, you're analyzing your traffic per page. This is not something that you put on your website as a whole. It's something you put on a particular page or as many pages as you want to track. So normally you'd put this on your index page. That's what most people want to know is who's coming to their website, the home page, but you don't have to. Every page that you do want to track needs to have this snippet of code. So I've just selected it so that I can copy it. And we've pretty much done the hardest part of this whole process. Again, the hard part's really finding your Google Analytics code. So if you have trouble doing that, you can search for that information in Google, of course, about how to find Google Analytics code. But as you can see, as long as you have a Google account and you're utilizing the Google Analytics service, just go to that administration area and look for something that lets you generate or find a tracking code called a UA code. So we've got ours here. I'm going to close out of this now and go back to 90 Second Website Builder. Once we're in 90 Second Website Builder, this part is super simple. What you do is you just go up to the page menu and we actually have a button that says Google Analytics. Click on that, and that automatically launches the page HTML feature in the software and even opens it up to where you need to put the code. So all we have to do is go paste, and now we've put our Google Analytics code on the page. That's all there is to it. Another way to get to this, by the way, I mean, this is the easiest way, just go to page Google Analytics, but what it's really doing is it's bringing up a feature that you can always bring up. If you right click on an empty part of the canvas and go to page HTML, that's really what's happening is it's bringing that up. But you need to know to paste that code between the head tags. It has to go in a special part of the page. And so that button up here is just a shortcut to bringing up the page HTML and opening up this tab so that you put your UA code in the right spot. So again, it's super easy to do. You click OK, upload your website to the internet, and let Google start tracking your traffic. That's how easy it is to do in 90 Second Website Builder.